Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my two-tick swordfish guide. This is going to be nice, quick, and easy, and we'll get right into it. All right, so here I am in Port Piscarillus, just west of the bank. You'll see this lobster anchovy spot. That's where you're going to want to be. And my cat just jumped on my chair. Hi, buddy. You scared the shit out of me. Um, all right, so this is what we're going to do. You are going to need a bow, nothing in your ammo slot, auto retaliate on, um, an angler outfit if you have it, not a huge deal if you don't, um, earth rune, body runes, and water runes, not that many of them, um, but a good handful of each, uh, rune pouch definitely helps, and a harpoon. Um, so what we're going to want to do is come over here to these spots and you're going to want to try and find the two rats that are closest to the east, because sometimes you'll get a rat that's over there. And while you're trying to set up one of the spots, they might de-aggro because their de-aggro range is somewhere around here. So we got two rats right here. We're going to cast one of these weak spells on it on the standard book. That way we don't do any damage. We don't kill them. We're going to grab that one too. And now the hardest part is setting this up. But the more you do it, the more comfortable you get. Um, I'm still getting used to it, but it's it's uh, it's not too bad. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want these rats to be attacking you on the exact opposite tick. So see how the two zeros are coming in at the same time? We don't want that. So the way I found to do it best is to stand two spots away and then run one spot uh, further. And as soon as this rat hits you, walk underneath it. There you go. It works perfect. It does not work perfect every time. You do have to play with it sometimes. Definitely easy to walk underneath them sometimes to get them off tick. But you can see, every time the zero disappears, another one pops up. They're never stacked. If the zeros are stacked, it is incorrect. Now, some people hear the word tick. Oh, tick, that's scary. I don't want to do tick. That's too intense. That's too sweaty. This is not like three tick barbarian, three tick chin chompa. It's not anything like that. It's so much easier. All you want to do is click on the spot every time a zero pops up. That's it. Zero pops up, I click. Zero pops up, I click. Look at this. Great XP. Very easy, very nonchalant, not sweaty at all. Now, if um, clicking when the zero pops up is a little bit weird for you, what I like to do um, is pretend that your guy is easily distracted and you want him to fish, but he keeps looking away. Like, oh, get back here, you know what I mean? Like, every time he looks away, click. Don't worry about the zeros, he looks away. Hey, come on, fish. Hey, what are you doing, fish? Hey, come back, fish. Okay, good, oh, fish. That's the way I do it, especially if I'm, you know, semi-AFK watching something. It's much easier to just, like, you see your character turn away, you click. But um, to get it set up uh, initially, um, the foolproof way is click when the zero pops up. Um, when the spot changes, I'll show you um, how to get over there without losing this cycle. It is also not full foolproof, um, but does work pretty well. So um, I will be back as soon as the spot changes. Oh, another thing I should mention, um, if you want to be sweaty with it, you can. I prefer not to. Um, the XP rates are a little bit worse doing it the way I do it, but it's still... The best XP you can pretty much get. I get like 90 to 110k XP per hour. But um, if you play on fixed mode, it's much easier to zoom in. And every time you fish, drop a fish. Fish, drop fish. But obviously, you know, I play in resizable. I can't really do it. But I'm not too stressed about it. Still good XP. Still fun. So the option is there if you need it. Click, drop, click, drop, click, drop, click, drop. I just get a full inventory. Shift, drop them all. Get back to it. All right, so I'll pretend like this spot disappeared, and we're gonna move over to this one. What I like to do is walk on the diagonal. That does not affect their pattern, and then I let them both hit me. So one, two, and then I walk. One, two, walk, one, two. I go past the spot, and then the diagonal back. And that's it. Click, zero, click. Yeah, it's as easy as that. This has been uh, a pretty humble uh, showing too. Um, you will uh, sometimes get them off tick when you move around or just getting them on the same tick right away can be a little bit of a pain in the butt. Um, but like I said, it's just the more you do it, the more you play with it, the better you're going to get and the faster your XP rates will be. Um, hey, I mean, that's pretty much it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, if you want to follow the channel, subscribe, like, leave a comment. 
and uh, check out my group Iron Man playlist. Um, we have seven episodes out, lots of fun, exciting content, and I'll be releasing another one tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching.